Greg Helm here. I'm with uh, PV, and I'm here at Sam Ash to tell you about the amazing IPR amplifiers. Uh, this is the second generation IPR2s, and uh, these are pretty amazing amplifiers. I want to show you something. This is a 7,500 watt amplifier. 7,500 watts. Look at this. I can just lift it, throw it, throw it around. If you guys are old enough to remember uh, Woodstock, they had 8,000 watts total at Woodstock. This is 7,500 watts. Now, the one thing I want you to, to really think about when you're purchasing an amplifier or anything that's powered, whether it's a speaker or a mixer or anything, is you're looking at the RMS rating of, of that power. Because a lot of people are now using peak or burst power, all these other things. Well, if you're using peak, that's the, that's the maximum it puts out before it stops working. That's a useless spec in my opinion. What we use is RMS. That is basically like your car sitting in the, car, in, in, uh, dr like sitting in the driveway idling. It'll work like that all the time forever. So when we say this is 7,500 watts, it's truly 7,500 watts RMS. If we were going to be like peak, we'd multiply that by four and say it's over 29,000 watts, which would be ridiculous. But um, don't be shocked, a lot of people do. The other thing is we rate ours at 0.01 THD, which is the industry standard. A lot of other people are using 0.05. So if you use five times distortion rating, you can up your power rating. But it's five times dirtier. It doesn't sound good. So just really be careful. Because when you're buying an amplifier, the PV amplifier is RMS 0.01, and it's tons of power. These things also never get hot. They're 95% efficient. It's new technology. I can literally be on this video for about another hour telling you about the technology, but I just bore you to death. What I recommend you do, you want an amplifier, we have a 2,000 watt, a 3,000 watt, a 5,000 watt, a 7,500 watt amplifier. All right, there's four versions, power ratings, and we also have four of the same power ratings in DSP, which you can go to the DSP page and look at that. Get one, pick it up at Sam Ash. They're great people. If you don't like it, they'll take it back, but you know what, when you get it, You'll never let anyone touch this amp again. Your system will never sound better, and you'll just love it. So check it out. Get one of these. You won't be sorry. Take care.